from Vienna, the city where nothing is wasted except for time. Welcome to Sox Talk Politics. Sox Talk Politics. Hello, and welcome back to Sox Talk Politics. You're probably wondering what happened to the neurotic old sock with the fuzzy hair who usually does this bit. Well, the truth is, we don't know. If anybody finds him, please slip him into a nice padded envelope and mail him to the address shown here. We will reimburse you for the postage, of course. Now, since Brian can't be here today, we thought... Brian? Where the sock are you? Kid... Thanks, Sock, you picked up. I sent you my location. Can you please get somebody to pick me up from here? Uh, Well, why is it so dark there? Oh, um, (laughs) yeah, it's kind of a long story and, um, an embarrassing one. Ooh, those are the best. Cue the intro, guys. Long Embarrassing Stories. Wait, are we on the air? I, um, I really don't think this is the right place or time for this particular, uh... Ah, uh, come on, Brian. Spill that tea like it's too hot to handle. <sighs> All right. It was a typical Wednesday, and I decided to have a tiny little drink after work. So I went to my favorite pub, the Old Queen's Thread and ordered myself a classic cocktail, Socks on the Beach. And who would have believed it? I ran into an old friend who I hadn't seen since my days at clown school. Let's just say things got a little wild. Wow, Brian, you crazy party boy. So, where are you now? I mean, where? Brian? A dumpster for socks sake, kid. Now, can you please get somebody to pick me up? Oh, and get my dry cleaners on the phone. Tell them it's an emergency. I hope they can get rid of the smell. No, 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 I know, I know. Let me see how full your dumpster is. That way we'll know when the garbage truck will come to collect you. I mean, that's like basically a free ride home, right? What are you talking about, kid? That's not how waste collection works. There's a fixed schedule. It doesn't matter how full the containers are, and you can't just look this up. It could be a week before somebody finds me. Brian, Brian, Brian. How mistaken you are, my dear old friend. A project from the city of Prague revolutionized waste collection and became a model for many other communities. Wait a minute. Are you going to cut to a project now, kid? I need you to get me out of here. You see, around the world, cities are faced with the challenge of increasing waste, combined with a lack of flexibility to adapt swiftly and appropriately. That is why the city of Prague launched this unique project. Waste containers throughout Prague were equipped with sensors enabling dynamic and efficient waste collection. By regularly checking automated collection routes, the city can adapt to changes in waste quantity and the city's infrastructure. Information on the fill levels of waste containers is available to city employees, to collection companies and to residents. Thus, the project not only contributes to improving city services, but it also encourages a positive attitude among residents towards waste sorting. Kid? A kid? Kid, get me out of here now! And that's it for tonight. We had a wonderful show, and we'll see you next time on Socks Talk Politics. Until then, don't forget to sort your waste and always stay on your toes. Your first time? Yeah.